I thank the honourable member for giving way and, uh, and very much welcome my honourable neighbour to uh, his first appearance at the dispatch box. But given what he has uh, just said about uh, his party uh, believing this is not too high a price to pay, given these changes actually are not uh, coming in and affecting these women until 2019, 2020, is he making a commitment today that were Labour to win the next election that these changes would be reversed? We are very clear that we cannot have constant changes in pensions legislation. One of the problems we face is precisely this, a constant chopping and changing of the timetable. So we will vote for our amendments tonight in the hope that the government's wisdom will, in their wisdom, will accept our amendments. And then, in that case, we will all be very happy, or at least happy on this side of the House.